Hey guys, Tasha here from Stardust Gold Crochet. Today we're going to learn how to do a decrease stitch called the front post double crochet three together. And I know that's a mouthful, but it's really not a hard to do. It's just decreasing using double crochets. So I've created here um, a chain and a single crochet row, and I've chained two at the end. So I'm going to go ahead and turn my work. We're going to work into the around the post of the, the first single crochet stitch of the row, not the turning chain. So what you do first, we're going to do three together. So you yarn over, go inside the, go put your hook back through underneath the bottom, the top two loops to the right of your post, and then go ahead and pinch so it's easier to pull through. Yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over, pull through two. We're going to do another one because we're going to be decreasing. So yarn over, insert your hook to the right, out the front, and then back around in, out the back side of it. Yarn over, pull up a loop, yarn over and pull through two. We're going to do it one more time because we're decreasing by two stitches. Oops, sorry guys, I'm off screen. Okay, so there you go. And I'm doing it around single crochets, which it's a little more difficult than doing it around larger stitches. But So here we have four loops on our hook. Then you yarn over and you're going to pull through all four. So what we've done here is we've turned three stitches into just one stitch by decreasing by two. So let's do it again. Yarn over, go in and around. Well, this is where it gets a little tricky because see, that's where you've already gone around that post. So. And I mean, it looks like you didn't, but you have to go around the next one. So go in and around the next one. Yarn over, pull up a loop. Yarn over and pull through two. And yarn over, go around. And we do that three times. gets a little tight too. You can pull your stitches out if you want. So there we have four. And then you yarn over and pull through all four loops on your hook. So what we've done here is we've decreased and this is a great stitch for hats, brims of hats. Um, you can do so many different things with decreased stitches. Um, it'll draw everything in together. So, And the back side looks like this. The front side has a little bit of a ridge to it. All right, guys, I hope you enjoy this tutorial. Please subscribe, leave comments below. If you have questions, I'd love to talk to you. And take care. Happy crocheting.